Hey everybody, welcome back to episode 2 of the 7 Sins official q and I'm your host, Sabby. With me, I have Conkro. Hello. And our special guest, the most sexy, beautiful man that I ever know, Beardy Man. Hello. Alright, so let's get started with some of these questions. We first start out with Claus, and he has two questions. Are you ready for this? How long have you been growing your beard? Well, um, I I actually started shaving when I was about 10. (laughs) I got given a um, a little, it's like a foiler. It's like a foil blade. It's like a foil casing, and it just like takes off stubble because I had so much stubble when I was a kid. And then um, I think when I was about 12 or 13, I had like, near enough a fully grown beard <laughs> so <Jesus Christ. laughs> yeah so yeah about 10 years something like that all right yeah and what made you decide to come to seven cents and become active uh well originally i came here for the modded lobbies for modern warfare 2 as every, as every noob does when they sign up or most noobs anyway um but I became active because I started like posting around a bit, and I was like, you know what? I'm gonna try and see if I can make a name for myself here. So uh, yeah, and I just stuck to it. Nice. All right. Moving on to the next question, we have Harkin. I hope I said that right. Probably butchered it. Sorry. So, Beardy Man, <laughs> what makes Seven Sins different? than all the other gaming communities you have been a part of? Um, uh, well, technically this is the only site I've been a part of, but I have signed up to a few others and lasted a bad day because I thought they were pretty shit, so <laughs> <laughs> I just thought I'd stick with this one. But this this place is like my second home. Like, There's so many great people here, the staff team are great, doing a good job to keep it running. Uh, everyone gets on well with each other. It's just like a really chilled out place to be, even though it's like through the internet. But yeah, I ain't, I don't really want to leave this place. I don't think I will. So yeah. Good thing I want to see you around with that sexy beard. <laughs> 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 All right, moving on to Zelkar's question. We have: When was the last time you shaved? And uh. <laughs> we'll continue with that portion here. So we'll start with that first portion of the question. Uh, um, uh, last week, when I fucked up shaving. <laughs> oh. Yeah. That's going to lead to an answer later on. <laughs> yep. <laughs> oh, man. I'm not looking forward to that. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Next portion of it is what led you to win the nicest member three years in a row? Um, just being me, I guess. Like, I appreciate everyone here. Like, you're all good people. I don't really have any problems with anybody. No, just be yourself, really. Uh, what led me to win? I, I can't say what led me to win because that was everyone's choices who they thought was win. But I know me and Sparfire had like really close calls with like competition, but she's just as nice. And, but everyone here deserves a chance to win it, so yeah. And if it wasn't going to be you, who do you think would have deserved it? Do you feel Sparfire? Um, I'd probably say Sparfire because it's always been me and her in the last two, or she'd come in second for it. But as I said, everyone else deserves it because. You're all a bunch of nice people, so, yeah. (laughs) (laughs) Alright, moving on to WWE. Why don't you color your beard rainbow colors and take a pic for us? Uh, Do I have to? (laughs) I will if you want me to. I mean, I'll just get like a stick on beard or something. (laughs) (laughs) My beard's not fully grown yet, so... You won't be able to see it. I've got stubble at the moment. I can't really color it. You gotta grow it out and bleach it. Okay, right. 
<laughs> oh, fuck. Come on, this is... Uh, it's like oh, an upside so... down clown. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, I'll, uh, I'll see what I can do. Okay. Try. There's no promises. There's no promises because I probably won't do it because I will look stupid. <laughs> and then you'll probably you'll probably call me a stupid idiot because that's what it says underneath your username on Seven Sins. So, <laughs> yeah. All right. Moving on to Feyapokin's question, we have Beardy Man. You've always been one of the few members of the community that I've always looked up to over the years. What drives you to be as consistent as you have been with your pleasant demeanor and positive attitude? Uh, this is one of the difficult questions. Um, uh, right. First of all, I appreciate your kind words at the top. That means quite a lot coming from someone like you, because I look up to you as well. Um, what drives me to be as consistent? <laughs> I'm, I'm quite short to be fair so um, I guess as I said earlier it's just like being myself I mean I have no reason to argue or uh, start anything with anybody I just try and get along with everyone as best I can and if they've got a problem with me then fair enough I can't, I can't really do anything about it it's up to them how they <laughs> think and feel so yeah I'm just here to help and listen and do what I can to be a good person, I guess. <laughs> and being happy, that's 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 important. You have to be happy. So yeah. Don't worry. Be happy. Hashtag <laughs> positive vibes. Oh yes. <laughs> <laughs> There's a couple of writers triggered. Alright, moving on to Zelkar's second question. We have <laughs> Are you secretly killer meme star? If I was, you'd already be dead. Damn. Boom. But but I'm not I'm not really a killer meme star, no. I'm I'm a I'm a beautiful beardy. <laughs> beautiful. Oh dear. Beautiful beautiful. beautiful. <laughs> Alright, right. we have Harry's question. <laughs> quite, <laughs> funny. <laughs> quite funny indeed. So Beardy Man, don't you find the beard to be annoying? I tried to grow one, and it was gone after not too long. It did my head in. So is it annoying, Beardy? It, nah, it's not annoying. A real man doesn't shave off his beard, but I did because I messed that's it up. Fine. <laughs> but it's the way you treat your beard, to be fair. I mean, I condition mine and shit like that, so i got to keep it fresh. Make it look popping. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Alright, moving on to how Beardy Man. I miss the good old days of you posting like crazy. So I guess my question is, what came up? Was it personal or professional that kind of made you slow down your activity over the years? Um, it wasn't, it was neither to be honest. I mean, I normally post in general discussion, so... I guess it was just like the sort of threads that were there just didn't sort of appeal to me or well, I couldn't think of a good enough sort of post to put in it but I've been trying lately to try and boost my activity up again because I mean that's literally all I do when I come in from work is just like get on Xbox and get on Seven Sins and just chill but yeah I'm gonna try and be like I was back when I first started, like posting like mad. It's just finding the threads to post in, to be fair. So, yeah. Alright. So, moving on to Dini's question, which is pretty much for all of us. Are any of you looking forward to the iPhone 7, 7 Plus, and or are you upgrading? So, I don't know if you guys have iPhones or not. I don't do mobile, and if I did, it wouldn't be Apple. <laughs> um, Samsung for me. I've just got the S7 Edge. It's a great phone. And for myself, I still have a 5S that works perfectly fine, and, you know, upgrading is not something I normally do unless my phone's pretty much trashed. 
and I've been taking real good care of this one for quite some time now. Alright, and... Hey Conqueror, you want to take a hack at that name? <laughs> uh, um, uh, two. There you go. His question is, Beardy Man, how do you turn a normal beard into a Beardy Man beard? It seems very well trimmed and man maintained. <clears throat> but or maintained. Man, it still works. <laughs> like, yeah, I was gonna say that works. <laughs> How often do you need to trim and whatnot? Um, a beardy man beard. <laughs> That's so funny. I like it. Um, there can only be one. Yeah, I guess so. There can only be one beardy man beard. So if you want to come and take this beard off me, you can try. Uh. <laughs> Trimmed and made, maintained, maintained, maintained. Uh, as I said, you gotta look after it. Like get beard oil, um, oh, special sort of like yeah, special like sort of products to like look after it. Uh, how often do you need to trim and whatnot? Um, well, I wouldn't have had to trim if I didn't mess up my beard. But I'm slowly waiting for it to grow back because I feel so naked when I walk out into the streets of Biggleswade. People look at me and think, what the fuck have you done? Because that's <laughs> what they know me for. They always see me like, no, because I'm the only one who has like a decent beard in Biggleswade, where I live. Everyone else can't compete. <laughs> no, nah, I'm not being big headed. But yeah, just look bearded. after it, man. Look after your beard and it will look after you. Right. And the final question, Beardy Man, to wrap Sorry. things up. <laughs> I know you've been anxious to answer this one specifically. <laughs> right. I'm just about to sign out of Skype. <laughs> All right. <laughs> no, <not really. laughs> no. So WWE asks, where's the detailed story on how you messed up your beard? Right. Okay. <laughs> uh, basically, I got my hair cut, and um, I don't style my beard. I got a friend to do it for me, so he like pointed out my sideburns and like made it curvy and stuff coming down onto my cheeks and that. And then it didn't look right, so I tried doing it myself with a plastic disposable razor blade. I've never done it before, and um, one side of my beard is like a bit patchier than the other. So it looked a bit odd when I was trying to do it. So every time, each side of my cheek on my beard was getting lower and lower and lower and lower. And you know what I thought? I was like, I can't, I can't do this now. I look like a fucking idiot. So I just like <laughs> got this razor blade. Didn't even care about cutting myself, and just shaved the whole fucking lot off. I was like, you know, get off. And then I got stuck with a goatee. So. Yeah, and then that looked even worse than all, because it wasn't even even either side of my face. <laughs> <laughs> so there was like a big chum, like clump of hair like sticking out on one side, and then it was nice and flat the other, and I was like, ah, oh, I give up. <laughs> and then I got my hair cut again last week and told him to shave it all off, so my, my stubble is all even all around my face now. So don't worry, my beard will be back soon, and I will be able to change my avatar again <laughs> to something a, a bit more normal. <laughs> uh, yeah, that's it. All right. So wrapping that up, uh, be sure to give Beauty Man extreme thanks by posting all over his wall and spamming him. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> but seriously, go ahead and thank him. Because he's <laughs> our first special guest here on the podcast, and we really appreciate you actually coming on and actually talking with us and answering all of the community's questions. That's cool. It's a pleasure. It's been a pleasure to spend some time, like, in voice, not over typing. Um, I would like to do it more often, like, obviously, if you guys want to add me on Skype, I'd be more than happy to do group calls and stuff. Because I rarely get to talk to anybody. I'm normally shy on TeamSpeak, or that, or in other reasons that my mic doesn't even fucking work on my laptop. So, <laughs> so, yeah. 
All right, everybody. Beardy man wants to hear from you. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I do. All right, Conqueror, you want to hit it up with the end? Uh, man, I guess that pretty much concludes the Q and A. Of course, we'll have another one. I don't know exactly who the next guest will be, but I can guarantee you it'll be somebody interesting for you guys. So keep on the lookout for the next thread and be sure to post all the questions that you have and try not to make them just for one specific person because you know me and Sabi's here too <laughs> <laughs> all right guys it's been a pleasure it's been beardy man thank you everybody take Con care Conqueror. bye and myself and have a great day <laughs>